Hello everyone and welcome back to Horse Haven! We are here in our French ranch looking over our horses and checking on how the beehives and the trees are doing. And I'm not sure if you guys were here with me when we managed to reach level 25. In fact, I'm pretty sure you weren't, but we reached level 24, 25. We're just zipping through those levels because we've been feeding our horses so much. And we have gotten more beehives! So look at these! We've got our beautiful beehives hanging out here in the front yard. I kind of want to move them around a little bit and add more beautiful flowers. Don't you think that would be nice? Just do a few flowers here and there. Maybe put another path coming down through here, coming through and going by the stables. I think that would be really fun. And we have so many delicious foods being prepared over in our bakeries from the carrot muffins to, oh, and apparently that completed a quest to the delicious apple cookies and even the pie. So we've got a lot of yummy things being prepared. We've got two of our little bakeries down here and I can't decide if I want to have like a small little bakery area down here, but probably. And there's our royal carriage. I am still so excited that we got that from completing the daily quest, which we actually need to do today as well. And today's daily quests include harvesting six corn, which I have done and collecting 600 coins in the Mexican steeplechase, which I also did, visiting four friends' ranches, which we will do in just a moment, harvesting six yellow feed, and a tricky one of nurturing a horse to level five. So I've only missed like two daily quests, and I hope that I can still get like the, the special item. So I've got my fingers crossed for being able to get the super special item. But we need to complete these tasks. Uh, I need to show you guys what's going on over in our, our German ranch. And then I need to show you what's going on over in our Montana ranch because there is just so much happening. Really quickly, I will introduce you guys to this handsome fellow over here. I don't believe you have met this Frisian. So we used to have a Frisian and we sold him ages ago. And I had to buy a horse for one of the daily quests a while ago. And I think we bought this little Frisian or he was born to some of our horses when we were trying to breed for a rarer guy. Hi, buddy. And we did not manage to uh, get the rare guy, but we managed to get this handsome fella. And at first I was going to raise him to level 10 and then we would sell him for diamonds the way we normally do. But I decided to keep him because we have expanded our stable. We've actually got more room over here in our big horse stable. And occasionally we do need a Frisian to breed up against for some of the new breeds, which I hope we can experiment a little bit with today. So let's go ahead. I want to add in... I'm gonna put him in now, just so that, hello Ace, we need to rename him. I need to go through some of the amazing names you guys have picked. But yeah, we're gonna put him in there. And we're still working on raising April the 3rd to be our champion horse with even more medals to her name. We're working on raising April the 2nd. She's such a sweetheart. Oh, we did raise April the 2nd. That's right, I was saving her. So we raised April the 2nd up to level 10. And now is the time to go ahead and we will be parting with a lot of our horses today, which is sad, but there's just not enough room. We already have a tier three Dutch harness, so we don't need a tier two anymore. And we're gonna say that April is retiring. So don't get sad, you guys. I know it's a little bit sad when we do say goodbye to some of the, the older horses we've had, but April the 2nd is going to be retiring so that she she will no longer be here for the breeding or the racing so she gets to go out and like go to a good horse pasture not the like horse pasture that you normally talk about but the horse out to pasture no a good horse pasture so we're gonna go ahead and sell her for 59 diamonds all right april you go lead a very happy good life and now we have a very important stable emptied out, which is good. We need those stables empty so we can add some little foals to uh, to them. So in fact, do we have any little foals in here? Because I need to raise a foal up to level five. Oh, look at this. I think this is one of the new breeds, the Lestinos. And I think that's going to be one of the new German breeds. There's an Anglio Norman, which we could probably use. He's kind of pricey, but we could afford him. There's a female. Oh, and there's an Anderness. We don't have one of these guys anymore. I think that they're actually pretty easy to breed. Are they in the little book here? Let's check really quickly. Let's see, Anderness, Anderness. Um, the sleeves, and there we go. Ardenus, Ardenus, uh, let's see. Uh, special. So they're, they're not super high up there. But I wonder if you breed them. There's the Welsh ponies. We don't have any ponies yet. We need to get some ponies, huh? Oh, wait, do we know all of the horses now? Oh, look, look, look. A forge. Oh my gosh. A Dutch warm blood and a Wittenberger. 
Or a Shetland pony would make one of these beautiful guys. How do we get a Shetland pony? We need a Welsh pony. To get a Welsh pony, we need we need a pony. <laughs> and we haven't I haven't seen a pony now that I think about it. I actually have not seen a pony in the market. So I'm gonna have to keep my eyes peeled for a pony in the market, because I really I haven't seen one now that I think about it. Come on, you little ones. So we could raise one of these guys up really quickly. Uh, they're, they're available for coins, and we have plenty of coins. In fact, we have over 500,000 coins. And I can hear you going, Siri, how do you have so many coins? It is 100% because I come on and race my horses all the time to relax. Uh, over at the Japanese steeplechase, and I'll race all of them that are available and just relax that way and get so many coins. And also, from the amazing mail that you guys have sent in. So thank you so much to Unknown, 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 Unknown Susanna, and Unknown for coming by to pet the horses. So thank you guys for coming by to pet the horses, hiring me as a stable hand. Thank you very much. Thanks for coming to visit the village. Woo, look at the breeding rewards. We will race in the Japanese steeplechase. I have no problem with that. In fact, let's go ahead. And just get that closed out. Let's see, and are there any achievements? We're about to get the clearing out all areas in the Montana Ranch achievement, so that'll be nice. And then, let's see, we can we harvested 15 carrot muffins, own four level 10 horses, reach 1,200 meters in a steeplechase, done. I still haven't figured out how to groom the horses. Do you guys know what that means? Because it's been days, and I haven't quite figured out what it means by groom the horses 10 times, so still working on that. Sell 10 carrots, own a level 10 horse in Germany, own a level 4 farm center in, in France. We might upgrade that today then. Buy one female horse. So there we go. Oh, and spend one more diamond and we'll be good there. So buy one female horse and harvest three honey. We can do both of those things pretty quickly. All right, let's get the honey put down. And then let's go visit our Montana ranch really quickly. We'll save our Germany ranch for a very special surprise in just a moment here. Alright, so jumping over to the Germany ranch. And if the sound's a little off, I apologize. It seems to be slightly odd tonight. Alright, and then let's go ahead and collect up the coins. So the Montana ranch, we're about to be able to clear out the last little cluster of trees. Personally, I would love to keep the trees, but it is part of having a, su a successful ranch here. All right, and then some of the other successful things that we need to do are some more breeding because we have our American warm blood. Now we need an American warm blood female. And we also need to be able to raise this guy up a little bit higher. This is one of those quick purchases. His name is Paco, but he was another one of those quick purchases we got because I needed to have a baby horse. You had to buy a male horse for one of the daily quests. So we bought him for a few thousand coins, and I figured why not just go ahead, raise him up. If we need to breed him against anything, we'd have him available, and if not, we can sell him for diamonds in the future. I like to think, the American Indian, I like to think that that's just our way of taking good care of the horses, getting them ready for a good home, and sending them off to a good home. Now, speaking of being able to send them off to good homes, it is time, actually, for our lovely lady right here. Our beautiful Nova, the tier 2 Leo that we have, to find a new home. She is up to level 11. We are ready to sell her in exchange for diamonds. I'm going to miss her a lot, but like I said, we are doing this specifically so that we can have those diamonds. And don't worry, we still have Lionheart and we still have her mom. Um, oh no, I forgot her mom's name. I feel so embarrassed now. Don't worry, but we still have Nova's parents. And her mom is in the horse stables and her dad, Lionheart, is over in, um, or Lionstar, excuse me. Why do I always say Lionheart? is over in the France stables. So we can pull her out, breed them again. We got Nova entirely because we were trying to get a tier two, a tier two Leo. And she's a tier one. So we're gonna go ahead and sell her now. I'm gonna miss her so much though. Oh my gosh. Bye Nova. And then we are trying to work on her brother right here actually, so that he can be up to tier 10. And he's almost there. He just needs some of this very fancy feed. It's like a jelly feed that we can actually get from Germany. And I actually have some of that cooking. So we'll go gather that up in a minute. Um, let's go ahead and harvest all of this feed up. There we go. So we're gonna get that zooming around. I've noticed, I think when you don't harvest the crops, it may lag things up a little bit over here. So if you notice a little bit of lag in your Montana ranch, try harvesting up all your crops and that really seems to reduce it almost immediately. 
And there are the six, six yellow feeds that we needed to get for the daily quest. So we can claim that, boom. So now we just need to visit four friends ranches and nurture a horse to level five. So let's go ahead and check and there's our American warm blood, or excuse me, our Redwood, who is our, um, yeah, our American warm blood. I was right. Yeah, I need to get you more, more cookies or more cookies, what? More carrots, huh? Yeah, we'll get him some more carrots pretty soon. He's almost to level 10. We're not gonna sell him at level 10 until we have a couple tier two American warm bloods. So that's our goal is tier two American warm bloods. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and get some carrots put down because they take a while to grow. In fact, I might as well get two rows of carrots. I love our little greenhouses in the back here. I think they're very, very pretty. And we're gonna put them over here and then we'll check the market to see what kind of horses we have over here. So anything good in the market today? A Frisian for hundreds and hundreds, standard bread for, so we've got some standard bread babies, but nobody, nobody I think we wanna reach out for just yet. And so what um, I think we're gonna do is actually we'll clear this out. Are you guys ready? Dun, 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 dun. Achievement unlocked. And now we've got the really cool painting. The really cool rock painting unlocked over here so we can walk over and look at it. I'm gonna have to add in so many cactuses to make up for taking away all the pretty trees, Oh, But at least that is out of the way. So we have got that huge expensive purchase out of the way and we can use our coins on other things now. All right, so we're gonna claim that. Woohoo! Got more experience and more coins coming to us. And then let's go ahead and we're gonna try breeding. We're gonna try breeding our Wellaria Cloud and Willow, and we're gonna see if we can get another female. We want a female American Warmblood. That's the goal. All right, that's this one right here. And it's a girl too. Okay, I really want her. Okay, okay, this is the goal. This is the goal. You guys ready? One, two. I went on two. I hope that was a lucky two. All right, all right, come on, keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. Stop, stop, stop. No, keep going. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we got a Rocky Mountain. So that is not quite the, the goal that we have on the full, but you know, that's okay. Xavier, the female, we can rename her. You guys have had so many amazing names and I keep forgetting to write them down. So I'm gonna start doing that again. So we can rename them properly. We'll go ahead and raise her up to a level 10. Maybe we'll keep her around to try to breed a tier two. I don't know. We'll work on that. And now let's head over to Germany where I do have some surprises for you. Dun 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 dun, here we go. On to Germany. Like I said, I'm sorry if the sound's kind of on tonight. I think the Horse Haven servers are having some issues. So here we are in Germany and we are almost done with the carnival tent, you guys. I think we'll be able to finish it tonight. I'm so excited. And you can see we've got the delicious little jellies back here and storage is full. So we need to feed some of our horses and we've got this handsome fellow right here. Very, very, very handsome horse named Rima. And he is absolutely gorgeous. And I would love to try breeding him against somebody. So today we are actually going to go out and we are gonna try to find a beautiful filly that Rima can be bred against. And we're gonna look among our friends' ranches for that. So that's gonna be pretty exciting. And of course, we still have the adorable Charm who is doing quite well. Look at her, she's almost level 10. I don't know what we could mix her with, but I would love to try out breeding her against some other things. All right, and then let's go ahead and we're gonna gather up all these coins, get them out of the way. There we go. Oh, and it looks like we've got some pearls going on back here. And the mini mine is almost ready to upgrade, by the way, you guys, but it needs 250 coins to upgrade. And I might do that, but we'll probably look at it together or I'll tell you about the bonuses it can give you in the future. Now we have the upgraded mine over here. There's a 50% chance of getting coins and there is a chance of getting three pearls or 10 diamonds with the second upgrade. And with the first upgrade, 50% chance of coins or pearls or the little rubies. And we actually have three rubies, 27 pearls, no emeralds, and no sapphires. So we're doing really, really well on pearls. And I wonder how we could decorate those. I don't know how you can use them as decoration. I still haven't learned that just yet. But let's go ahead and I want to see if we can get some more rubies. So we're going to start for the ruby search. 
And then we're gonna come down here and let's do the little quiz stand one last time because I think we're gonna be able to build the carnival tent today. All right, which of the following is a German horse breed? Um, this one. Sounds like a German name. Yes, yeah, so and we got the last pretzel we need. Let's keep going though. Science quiz. The, cham the champagne gene is the dominant allele that gives horses, um, rare coat colors. Yay, we got another prize. Science quiz. In biology, what kingdom are horses part of? Oh, pfft. Okay, the protozoa is going to be like your single-celled organisms, fungi, that's like mushrooms, you guys, and animals, that's animals. That's fun. I, of course I knew that one. I'm a biology major. All right, then we're going to come over here to the construction tent. We're going to serve the very last pretzel, and we're going to see what happens. Finish! <gasps> there we go, you guys, look at that! So that's what it is! It's literally like a little, a little carnival thing. Look at it! Oh my goodness, that's, that's kind of really ridiculously cute and silly. What is, what is this, what is this button? What does this mean? <gasps> Redeem great prizes before they go. What, what? So you take your gems and you can like redeem them for different things. You can redeem your soybeans for pearls. <laughs> you can redeem a horse. If you have a rare American paint, you can, Redeem, do I have an American paint named Philippe? I, 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 what? Okay. I don't think I do. Oh, I do. Maybe I do. Do I have an American paint? Redeem, you do not have enough. Oh, to get an American paint. I get it now. I get it now. I was so confused. <gasps> Look at this. I want this right here this thing right here what is that i need four i need four i need four of these fancy things we just sold a bunch of horses oh my gosh okay i'm going to get more diamonds we're going to be raising our, our updates in six hours we're going to be raising more horses you guys because we're going to turn around and we're going to be able to sell them for diamonds and then turn the diamonds into these gems and then get the special items from the carousel because oh my goodness that is so exciting oh my gosh you guys okay so we're going to work on that I'm going to work on that and i'm going to grow lots and lots of soybeans and we can redeem them for oh you can only redeem them once apparently and we'll redeem them for pearls so there you go wow okay i'm super excited that's our new goal is is to get some more of like these gems and it's gonna cost us like lots of diamonds to do that so i need more horses speaking of needing more horses let's go ahead and we're going to try breeding up rima because i think he's going to be one of the most interesting to breed since we haven't bred them yet but let's go ahead and I will take care off screen of the little foal that needs to be raised up to level five. Don't you guys worry about that. It'll probably just be a little female in France that I'll adopt real quick. And we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna visit some of our friend's ranches. So let's visit Poppy's German ranch and see if she has a nice female that we could breed Rima with. Maybe another one of his kind to try for a tier two, maybe somebody different to try for like a Lestino or a different German breed that we haven't met yet. Hello, beautiful horses. Ooh, I like your your beautiful stables. All right, so there's a male and a female Irish sport. We have an Irish sport, so I'm okay there. There's Maline, so let's go to Maline's ranch. There's a whole bunch of unknowns, so I don't I don't know the unknowns' names, but you guys might be one of those unknowns and recognize your ranch would be very exciting. <gasps> there we go. This is what I'm talking about. And they've got their, oh my gosh. Being just a few levels higher than me and they have got this place decked out. I love it, I love it. All right, so what is this? A Jotland, very nice. A male Jotland, a female Jotland. And it looks like this male is like tier two and the female might be tier two as well because this one's different. And then this one is a female. She's very pretty though. I like her speed. Um, I like these guys. Oh, they've got good speed too. Ooh. Okay, so we might be back to Maline's place in just a second. Let's visit one of the unknowns. Just because I, I feel I think the people who at the top I tend to visit a lot. So I'm trying to, you know, spice it up a little bit for you guys. But yeah, let's come over. See what's going on over here. Hello, beautiful horses. Hackneys. A female hackney with really good jump. 
a elite uh, hackney, so an elite male hackney. Um, and then let's see, let's try Meline. I'm probably gonna want your thing. Why do I only have such a short friend list? Oh, I guess those are all my only friends with the German ranch, maybe? That can't be it. We'll figure it out. Like I said, I think Horsehaven's being a little bit finickety tonight, so we'll just have to see what's going on. All right, oh, I like this. I like this setup. So a couple Irish sports. Ooh, and look at this. What the, oh, I think that's the market upgraded. Very pretty. All right, or maybe that's the market. No, I think that's the little juice making thing. All right, so I think we want to go back to Malene's German Ranch. And I just like the look of these guys. So let's go ahead and try breeding them and see what we get. So one of the females, we're gonna go ahead and, can I breed this female? Is that something I can do? No available male horse to breed with her? That is lies! I have a male horse who can breed with her. Okay, I guess we're doing this instead. <laughs> oh, Rima's a girl! <laughs> Sorry, Rima! <laughs> I thought you were a boy! Oh, no wonder! Okay, well, we've got this lined up. And we could have a Jutland Elite. There's a chance of that. Or just a Jutland. I'm probably saying these names totally wrong and I apologize. So let's go ahead. So they're both the same variety. And let's go ahead and see if we can have that little elite. Pink, 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 pink. Pink, 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 pink. Pink, 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 pink. Come on, pink. Come on, pink. Come on, pink. No. All right. Well, that's okay. We've still got some adorable new baby foals coming to us. So that's always something worth celebrating. But all right, you guys. So let's head back to our main ranch. We have now got the carnival going and now we have some huge motivation to get those diamonds because I want to buy some of those emeralds so we can get the really amazing decoration pieces because oh my goodness. Oops, and see what I mean? Horse Haven's having a little bit of a hard time tonight. So yeah, we're gonna try to get uh, this amazing thing, hands down. In fact, I know I want it. So, okay, no, all right, all right, we'll figure this out. We'll figure this out. Horse Haven's having a hard time. Buy one. I'm gonna buy one for now and I'm gonna keep it up above 200 um, diamonds if I can help it. But alright guys, thank you so much for joining me. It's been amazing. I forget just how much amazing relaxing fun it is just to see the horses and be able to interact with them and run the steeplechases and show off all of the new breeds and the babies that we have. And I can't wait to share some more of the amazing adventures, especially as we start getting these limited edition items. I really want them. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye bye